Welcome back to Jersey Matters. Dawn Sands Lamenti and welcome to a patriotic tiny town that's one of a kind in our nation. This is Flagtown, USA. This is the only flag town in our nation, a place where pride, patriotism, and the American flag are respected and honored every day. My aunt built the post office. My grandparents came here turn of the last century. They had a little farm right over here, and my, they gave a piece of property to my aunt, who um, got the charter from Eleanor Roosevelt. She sent a letter to Eleanor Roosevelt because she had polio very bad, and of course Franklin Roosevelt had polio, and Eleanor Roosevelt arranged it so that she could open a post office here. So my grandparents gave my aunt a piece of property and my father a piece of property. In 1946, he, cre he created this gas station. Three generations later, the Guerrero brothers, Bobby and Randy, own and run this gas station in the heart of town. They're part of a community that cherishes the history of families of military veterans. What does the flag mean to you? Oh, there's a million things. I mean, uh, the American Revolution, independence, uh, free enterprise, there's a, quite a few things. It's, it's special here, Flagtown. Of course, Flagtown was not named after a flag. It was named after Jacob Flag, who was a Dutchman that owned quite a bit of, but over the years, it, it evolved to reference to the flag. But the original provenance of the name came from Jacob Flag, who was a Dutchman that owned quite a bit of property here in the 1700s. Inside the small historic post office, residents pick up their mail because there is no house-to-house -house mailbox delivery. Everybody knows Glenn Fry, who's worked here for decades. He says it gets quite busy here during holidays, such as the 4th of July and Flag Day, because people come from afar to drop off their outgoing postcards and letters to be hand-canceled by the famous Flagtown stamp on days relating to the flag, making the cancellation name and date a unique patriotic souvenir. The flag is, it means a lot. To a lot of different people, it will mean different things, especially if you served or lost a loved one or, you know, it, it means different things to different people, but hopefully all good. June 14th, 1777, the Second Continental Congress formally adopted the Stars and Stripes as the official flag of our new republic. Here in Flagtown, the fire station sign reads, Land of the Free Because of the Brave. For townspeople, the flag is also a symbol of eternal gratitude to our service members. This day and age, a lot of people disrespect the, our veterans, but uh, I feel that's definitely wrong. I mean, and they, they, a lot of people disrespect the flag right now. There's an atmosphere in this country where, where you um, have a chance to protest, but you're using the wrong means. You're using the flag to protest. I don't believe they should do that. Reporting from the one and only Flagtown, New Jersey, Dawn Stenslamenti for Jersey Matters. Up next, Larry's commentary.